So you want to shoot a YouTube video using non-copyrighted, royalty-free images and photos. And you have searched on pixabay.com. You can't find enough stock-free photos. Now, you've checked on Pexels and you've checked on many other websites that offer non-copyrighted photos. You cannot find the pictures, the images that suit your subject matter. What if I teach you a way to get non-copyrighted, royalty-free photos on, and images on Google? Yeah, you Google it, then you'll find the images that are non-copyrighted and are free for you to use at any time. Yeah, there's a method to it. You don't just go on Google and you take any image. I'll show you how to find non-copyrighted, royalty-free photographs and images for your video are you interested to know what this is are you interested to know how to do this then make sure you stick around so to get non-copyrighted pictures for your videos as a content creator via youtube the first thing you need to do is to open up google.com from your browser and now that it has opened up uh, let's say you are doing a video about fitness and you need non-copyrighted pictures of a man in a gym that you want to use as overlay while you do a voiceover for your videos so the first thing you do is let's say we type a man in a gym okay in the okay now i have it highlighted here a man in a gym okay so a man in a gym so I'll pretty much just uh, I'll pretty much just tap on it okay now it has opened up and um, you see that this cursor uh, is on all here all so what we want to do is we want to change it to images so we click on images right so that the filter we change the filter to images by tapping on images okay right now we have different images of a man and a gym now kindly note carefully that majority of these pictures right in front of you of men in a gym are copyrighted and if you use them indiscriminately you may end up with a copyright strike Okay, so first thing we need to do now, before we begin this strategy, um, for those of you that are using laptops, MacBooks, you don't have to do this next step. But for um, people using mobiles, mobile phones, just like this browser I'm using, it's a mobile phone, we need to, you know, change the format of our browser to a desktop version. And how do you do that? Now, you see these, uh, you see these, tool now you see this three vertical dots at the top right hand corner of your browser is where you will need to click okay so when you click on it in the drop down you're going to look for desktop site okay desktop site and once you find it you're going to check it and the moment you check it automatically uh, it will bring the desktop version of your browser now the next thing you need to do now is click on tools here is tools yeah tools so now let's click on tools real quick now, when you click on tools, you will now find usage rights in the drop down. So, when you click on usage rights in the drop down, you will find uh, all, you'll find creative commons licenses, and you have commercial and other licenses. So, the one we are interested in is the creative commons licensing licenses. So we're going to click on Creative Commons Licenses. 
okay so let's click on creative commons licenses now now I've clicked on it now voila that is the end of this strategy because right now the moment you apply creative commons licenses to the filter underneath the user uh, rights you will have in front of you non-copyrighted pictures <clears throat> that you can use for any of your videos okay all these pictures of a man in a gym you can freely use them uh, for your videos now instead of uh, you know, visiting individual sites like Pexels, Pixabay, looking for your non-copyrighted pictures. It is best you use this Google strategy because this Google strategy brings together pictures from different non-copyrighted um, uh, libraries, online libraries and websites, brings them all together under the search that you made. You know, it combs the internet looking for non-copyrighted Creative Commons licenses pictures that you can use. So it's better than, you know, having to visit individual websites where you might not get exactly what you want. Here you have an array of choices from some of the best non-copyrighted pictures relating to your search matter on the internet. I hope you like and you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like. It helps the YouTube algorithm to recommend it to more and more people. Uh, endeavor to share this video with every content creator they need to see this. And um, subscribe to this channel if this was your first time. Till I see you in the next one, I remain Victor Sibo. It is bye for now.